this video is presented by Logitech Gaming. If you guys want to check out all their products, I'll, I'll have a link down in the description. I hope you guys do enjoy this video. Yo, what's up guys? It's your boy WMW3 Game Present. Today's video, guys, we'll be talking about the new graphics card. Yes, I was just talking about it last week. And what do we have here? Another one from NVIDIA. So they were like answering press conference and stuff. And they actually unveiled it right then and there. Nobody expected it, but they did nonetheless. So what am I talking about? So the big bad like graphics card line from NVIDIA. If you guys unfamiliar with nvidia when you hear nvidia the biggest like the bad not the baddest but like the most beefy spec graphics are, are pretty much a titan that's it's a titan but a lot of people go with 980 ti's because it pretty much gets the job done basically it's pretty much the same thing as a titan but what we have here is the nvidia g uh, nvidia titan x this thing is an absolute monster for 1200 dollars this is like a graphics card that could do anything on 4k pretty much if you want to make two graphics or if you want to combine both of them that would be just insane amount of performance so i'm going to show you some of the specs you can see it on your screen right now and i'll read some of the specs out for you if you guys don't want to read so nvidia cuda cores are 3584 base clock is 1470 boost clock 1531 memory speed is 10 gbps standard memory config is 12 gigabytes that you need a very good like computer to run this graphics card so i'm assuming like i7 probably with like you could take 32 gigs of ram but i don't think you need 32 is probably overkill but 32 you could do pretty good with it so and this graphics card they're perfect all right so memory in, in interference wide is 3384 bit memory bandwidth is 4480 so the technology that supported this should be all the nvidia technology to support vr is, uh, it should be ready so vr ready nvidia Ang angles angles is ready nvidia g-sync is ready nvidia game stream is ready so basically that just means you can stream your game right then and there so nvidia nvidia gpu cp i mean yeah gpu boost clock yes so there is a gpu boost clock display is 1768 by 14 i mean 430 4320 60 hertz so Yes, this thing can power 4K monitors with ease. Multi monitor, yes, it supports multi monitor. So, recommended system power 600 watt. Graphics card power is 250 watt with 1.8 pin and 6, 6, 1.6 pin adapter. So, like I just said, we I was just talking about graphics cards last last Friday about how the best budget graphics cards right there. But this thing is a monster for twelve hundred dollars. If you guys are looking for something um very good that could handle all the games and you may not need to upgrade anything pretty much with this guy. So you may not need to upgrade graphics card for two three years to be honest with you. This thing could handle pretty much all the new games that comes out and 4K. This should this graphics card should be easily handling. 4k games so personally this is a bang for your buck for 1200 bucks this is an excellent deal so if you guys did like this video please remember to smack that like button that's much appreciated if and i want to say thank you guys for watching as usual so next saturday i probably won't be here but there will be videos going up when i'm not here so hope you guys have a wonderful wonderful saturday i'm out guys peace have fun